Selena, I'm coming for you. I'm gonna make it. Oh, now he's walking. Hello, everybody, and welcome to my channel. My name is Pineapple, and today I'm doing another episode of my Wishing Well Legacy Challenge. So, this is a legacy challenge with a twist. The twist being that my Sim Selena has to wish for certain things from the Wishing Well on certain days. So, on Saturday, she wishes for simoleons. Sunday, she wishes for skills. Monday, she wishes for happiness. And Tuesday, she wishes for simoleons again. And then on Wednesday is Wild Card Wednesday. Thursday, nothing. And Friday is Freaky Friday. So on Wild Card Wednesday and Freaky Friday, I roll the die to determine whether she wishes for romance, a child, grades, promotion, youth, or life. Woo! So <laughs> if you're confused by any of that, it's in the description box down below. So um, this is Selena uh, back from her... Um, birthday she just turned into a young adult and she is about to crash and so right now I'm gonna quick like I changed her outfit um or like you know I gave her a new wardrobe and whatever and so before that she was like already on the ground but then when I reloaded in the game she's upright mostly but about to fall so I'll show you that little screenshot of her like already on the ground <laughs> because <laughs> that face so um but now I will um we will all partake in the fall of Selena, and so hopefully that should be fun. Okay, here we go. Bam! Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry about that. Um, but yeah, so Selena, the we had a birthday party at the restaurant, and it just took a long poop time, and so everybody's like, this ain't gonna be good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like... I think that um, Corbin is the only one that is still mostly living, um, but I will get him to um, hop in bed, and uh, when Selena gets up, I will also get her to hop in her bed, and everybody else is sleeping, and so um, the only person I'm really worried about is Margot. I think she might have to miss work today, because she is like, yeah. So I'm just going to wake her up real fast, and... Um, have her take a vacation day just because she is not going to be good for work and she is a little old lady and we got to take care of our little old ladies um so i'll just have her um hop back in bed until she is so uncomfortable that she has to wake back up again um which should be kind of soon because her needs go down really fast um and so corbin is up um and i think mostly he'll just take care of himself but um but um <laughs> so today um oh i know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna quickly show you um selena's makeover okay and i'll be back in a second okay so this is selena's first everyday look and uh i didn't change a whole bunch about it i wanted to keep it because it's the thumbnail picture um and i just love it and we've kept margo's um like everyday wear her like iconic one yeah, we've kept that through all of the seasons. So I figured this could be a look we can keep for a while for Selena. But here are some of her other everyday looks. Some of them are edgy. Some of them are more girly. And then here is that formal wear you saw her collapse in. And then she has a couple of um, exercise outfits because I'm thinking of putting her into the um, like athletics career and so I didn't change her night clothes just because I really liked how they looked and yeah um, and I think I didn't change I think I forgot to change this but it looks good and then this is her new swimwear so I hear people moving upstairs so I hope you guys can hear that but let's hop right back into the game okay so I don't know why she just hopped out of bed and back in but like I was saying I'm thinking of getting Selena into the athletic career um, I think because that's her aspiration randomly chosen, so I think that could be good. Oh, thanks, Clara. Congratulations on your recent birthday. Yep, that happened. Um, oh, Corbin, go to school. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so everybody's kind of like, everybody except for Corbin is dying because Corbin didn't go with us because um, it was more of a girl's night out. But <laughs> I'm going to fast forward a bit until it is everybody's a bit more manageable in their needs. Okay, so now everybody is like not dying as much and so I'm just getting Selena to play some games so she can kind of level up and 
fun. That's not a thing. So she can just have more fun. And Connie is writing. And we made a whole bunch of money from the books. Um, we made almost $4,000 from books today. Uh, from Connie's books. So that's really great. Um, Margo, let's have you continue to paint. Well, we'll get you inspired first. Let's have you cloud gaze. And so then she can finish this painting out here. Because I'd really like to be able to make a lot of paintings for the house too. I think that'd be really, really nice. Um, who's calling? Let's see. I, a ghost, a ghost that has no intestinal tract anymore, I'm guessing, I'm starving. Want to go grab lunch with me? No, no, no. I don't know you. And you're a ghost. Like, why? <laughs> That's ridiculous, ridiculous. Um, but so I just noticed that today is Tuesday and so yesterday it was supposed to be Monday and I think I got it mixed up and I wished for simoleons instead of happiness. I feel like I wish for happiness though. I think I jumped the gun on wishing for simoleons. So I'm going to make sure that I play all the way through to Wednesday so that we can make a wish from the wishing well in this episode just because I thought that I don't even know what I thought I don't know but I got it a little bit mixed up so I'm sorry about that um but the plan for today once Corbin comes back from school um Selena will invite Marcus over because he's still a teenager and we can't have that um so she's leveled up and fun we'll have her um take a quick shower and then we'll have her start making some cake so let's see um cook cook okay i was like hello uh she'll have we'll have her make just a hamburger cake um that will clean up your guys's mess so messy oh did you finish your painting oh and you're back from school hello <laughs> he needs fun well you can take care of yourself but um you are taking out the trash oh you finished this very nice. What is this? Excellent. Perfect. So we'll just have her sell that. Wait, not you. Shoot. I'm under this thing. Well, we'll have him play video games. Sorry, I'm like all over the place. Um, play game, flip block. You, um, sell this. Um, and we'll have her clean out the spoiled food. Um, and Marco should be nearing completion of this book soon so that should be nice um but yeah so in a minute after selena's done making marcus his birthday cake she will call him over and i think that'll be really cute you know that she made him a cake and then we're gonna eat him up and so that should be really good um <laughs> uh yeah because he needs to not be a teen anymore that'd be good i really wish that sims wouldn't get confident after painting pictures that's so annoying. I wonder if I can get her to like look at art or something and maybe that'll get her more inspired again. Oh, you broke it. Whatever. Whatever. We'll have her mop it. You break it, you mop it. <laughs> kind of sounds like bop it. So that'd be fun. Oh, did you finish it? Yeah, yeah. So she finished writing the book. She's hungry and she needs fun. But before you do that, let's um sells a publisher this um what level was that at what are you you are an excellent so it's not a masterpiece or anything oh and she also has a picture of food she has a picture of food i should put it somewhere from when we went to the restaurant oh we can put it in this like really sad sort of living room yeah that looks nice and we'll add it into the frame and yeah that looks good um and so yeah, there's that. So um, once the cake is done, Selena will go ahead and invite Marcus over. Well, after she put a candle on it so that nobody eats it because they do that. Where are you doing? Oh, you're mailing your book. Okay, sorry about that. And bam. Oh wow, she reached level two of the cooking skill. So let's add birthday candles to that and then invite your boyfriend over. Um, um, always, every time. Uh, there we go. <laughs> he isn't as fancy wear, I think. I don't know why. Um, 
But yeah, so that that should be fun. That should be a lot of fun. And Connie, why don't you make that fancy new dish that you learned how to make? So is it, I think maybe under gourmet meal? Um, she learned how to make it. I don't know. I haven't actually played around with the um, really fancy cooking. Maybe it's just in normal cooking? Let's see. Looking for the black plate. Um, eh, yeah, I have no idea. Well, we'll just have her make a tire roast chicken. That's always fun. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, so there's so many things. Oh, wow, Margo, you earned $1,000 almost on your day off. Wow, we are starting to, like, roll in the money. You know what we should do? We should get a banister <laughs> for this staircase. I've been wanting to get one. I noticed in the last episode that I hadn't even painted the side of the staircase. So let's just grab a quick one. Um, okay. <laughs> just because that was bugging me that it didn't have any railings. Oh my gosh, Selena looks kind of sad just sitting here waiting for Marcus to show up. Um, and so, ah, you're confident, but we'll just have her paint something anyways let's go with um pop art large pop art let's see what that produces but yeah i'd really like to have some stuff of um oh my god i'm blanking on my founder's name margo's um some like reminders of her for when she passes um that'd be really good just because eh, we're starting to get into it into those years and that's really sad that's really sad. Okay, Marcus, where are you? Did he say he wasn't going to come over? Yeah, he's going to be right over. I guess he has to, like, run over the mountain or something. Where are you? I feel like I'm, like, hunting in the forest for him. Um. Well, his house is over here somewhere. Oh, here he comes. He is running. It's like a little marathon. It's actually kind of romantic. He's, like, running all the way from his house. He's like, Selena! I'm coming for you. I'm going to make it. Oh, now he's walking. Nope, I'm going again. We're going to make it. We're going to make it. Okay. So far away. This lot is actually really annoying because nobody spawns like at the front. They always spawn on the other side of the freaking island. Um, and it's just so annoying. It takes them forever to get over here. But, you know, it is how it is. Ooh, Margo leveled up. That's nice. Um, and Connie, you made some excellent chicken, um, and so that's all good. Uh, you know, you just have fun somehow, because you're, like, dying. Um, but this is gonna be a painting of a dude. Whoa! No. We're selling that. When you're done with that, because that face is not what I want to be seeing. No. It's really, really not. It's really, really not. Um, did you not ever put candles on this cake? I told you to. No, don't blow out the candles. Oh, there are no, like, weird. That's weird. Maybe if we move it over here, they'll show up? Yeah, there we go. I was like, where did these candles go? Um, but Marcus... Oh, okay, he's coming. So I think now that he's on the lot, I can have him blow out these candles and he will age up. Yeah, we go. Age up Sim, Marcus. Marcus, and you can just go here. <laughs> just go there. Um, and so that should be good. Hopefully, yep. Come on, Marcus. Come on up. Come on up. And so then they can start being more romantic, and then hopefully we can get him moved in soon, and then engaged, and all of those cute things. That should be a lot of fun. Oh my gosh. <laughs> You're singing. Perfect. Whoa, and Margo finished a masterpiece. There's lots of good stuff happening. Wait. Wait. This is your masterpiece? Well, you best be selling that masterpiece. My gosh. Um, yeah, sell that thing. Yep, get that out of my house. Um, so yeah, we'll have her, um, why don't you do another pop art painting, but hopefully not that same one. Um, and so now that um, he's aged up, now she can, whoa, they can do a lot of stuff together. <laughs> but she can, like, flirt with him again. Because when she's an adult and he's a teen, even though they had a romantic relationship, they couldn't, like, do stuff together, and that's fine. Um, 
but yeah, they can be all cute together, and yeah, oh, they're so cute. They're so cute. Yes, they are. Oh, they're really cute. Um, but yeah. <laughs> One second, I'm gonna check on something. Okay, sorry about that. I'm like missing Connie's novel that she wrote about herself. Like, I have the copy here, but you can't sell that, and so I don't know what happened to it if I did end up selling it. I thought I was waiting to sell it for some reason, but so sorry about that. Um, but I just realized that Selena also has pictures of um, her and Marcus, so I figured we could put one of those up. Which one is the best? Okay, so we have a couple to choose from. Quality poor. <laughs> They're all poor quality. Oh, that one's normal. But we will sell that one, and now we have some cute pictures of them up. Um, and so, yeah, I'm wondering, I think I might just have her buy him and move in. I think it's time. So let's see. Um, more choices. Um, friendly. I asked to move in. Here we go. You move in with me and my parents and my brother? You, my romantic interest? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Woo. We got him moved in. <laughs> okay, so now we got to make sure that no money gets put into the household. Good. Oh, he's leaving his parents. That's kind of sad. Um, that's actually really sad. He's just leaving his parents behind. Um... But yeah, so now we have Marcus moved in, so that's really exciting. And so I think just to... Oh, wait. No, I was going to wish from the wishing well. That's what I'm going to do. Okay. So <laughs> I need to make it through the day a bit first. Um, but <laughs> sorry. Oh, oh, wow. Hello. She's like, yeah, you moved in with me. Oh, that's really cute. Um, but let's have her find a job so uh, let's see find a job and we'll also have Marcus find a job too um I imagine him as being a painter I've imagined that since I regretfully put him in this outfit because ever since that he just he looks awful in the outfit he looks like he's just nope unclean so like I said Selena will get the athlete career and I've never played around with that so that should be fun and then Marcus um should be getting into the painter career and so that should be really cute that should be really cute. Okay, and painter. Bam. Oh, what happened there? <laughs> he found a job and they're not friends anymore. Um, But yeah, so I'm going to quick speed through today. That way we can go wish from the wishing well. Okay, so um, we are now on the evening and it's super cute because Marcus is already painting. And there was a second there where he was painting with... Connie or Margot. Um, but yeah, so here the wishing well is looking like he wants to kill us. So I'm gonna have her um, make an offering. Um, and so hopefully that makes him happier because I don't want him to kill us. Oh, good. Corbin finished his homework so he can just go to bed. Oh, yep. The wishing well is ready to grant our wish. Okay, so it is, well, in 20 minutes. Let's just, we'll have her, we'll just have her. Write a song in the meantime for the next 20 minutes in the game. Playing the music. Okay, there we go. Now I will roll the die and um, to see what we wish for because it is now Wednesday and for Wild Card Wednesday. So she wished I got roll. I rolled grades, but she's not in school anymore, so I'm going to re-roll. Okay, I rolled romance. Can she do romance? Make a wish. Nope, she can't because she's in a relationship, so sorry about that. And I'll roll a third time. Oh, she got youth. That's so annoying. <laughs> but we're going to go for it. She's already, like, just aged up. But, you know, I don't want to roll the die for a fourth time. So hopefully this doesn't make her old or something. I know, but it looks good. Okay. We've just turned the clock back one day. Okay. Time is definitely on Selena's side. A few additional days have been added to her overall lifetime. Actually, that's pretty good. So it doesn't really, I don't think, yeah, no, it didn't set her back um, with her age thing, but I think in the end, it'll add to her lifetime. So that is really good. But 
Um, sorry if this episode was a little bit short or long or whatever, um, but I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to leave a like, a comment, or subscribe, especially if you would like to see the next episode. You will get updated on it. But I hope that you guys are all having a good day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>